welcome back to my channel what is up you guys and i want to show you guys how i make my favorite juice this is a papaya juice and papaya is a fruit that i've i've known of since i was living back in the virgin islands and it had a tree in front of my porch literally very tall papaya tree and we my neighbors and i will take some of those papaya when they grew big and we will make juice out of it and i was craving that for so long and i've every now and then every time i find it on um amazon fresh i just order one or my mom will go to the store and bring one and it's been my juice routine for like three months now literally so yeah i want to show you guys how i make it and yeah i think the neighbor's tree it was the neighbor's tree and i used we, me and my mom used to just take it <laughs> but anyways i just want to show you guys how i make mine and yeah this is like my second round and it's still good so stay tuned let's make it i'm excited to show you how i do my papaya juice i already chopped up some papaya and i had it in the um refrigerator for some time well from yesterday yesterday i did make some juice and i have my eyes the papaya ready this was frozen by the way and it's i'm trying to let it um defrost a little bit more don't mind all this other stuff i have my coffee that i was drinking and sugar i got some carnation milk and i'm about to pull this out so that i can make that juice and start my day i have some milk here i'm using this one for now because it's just a little one it needs to be done soon so i can get the other one that i like and the lactose intolerant one that's the one i like anyway so let me show you how i get this going so yeah um First, I'm going to take the papaya. And I have, you see how frozen they are? <laughs> A little bit frozen. That's all right though, because this frozen means that it has some ice in it already, as you can see. And I don't have to put so much ice since it already has a good amount of ice in there. This is, this reminds me of the frozen fruits that comes in the package. I haven't done any juices from those ever in my life so I, i'm pretty excited to try that i think i'm getting some tonight from my order my groceries order so hopefully yeah now this is a this this one here is a good chunk but let me fix that up better you know you don't want this machine to get too much um you don't want this machine to get too much ice like real big chunky ice because it can mess up the machine this is not the other machine that can um take big pieces of ice and just crush it no this one is more delicate so i'm just being careful i think that's enough papaya Yep, that's enough for papaya. This one is going back in the freezer. Alright. Put 
the good amount of sugar like this you know you want this to have a good amount like because you want your papaya juice to come out sweet so not I, I really don't mind for it to be like so sweet my mom lo loves it really really sweet but i like it mild i don't really care for all of this sugar so that's enough this is going back in its shelf here there it goes now I have some carnation milk and I'm going to pour in as much as possible. That's a really good amount. And I'm gonna make sure um, syrup is this what this this is called in, in what this is called in English? Sabor vanilla blanca. Well you you can see what it is. I think this is a little bit of vanilla syrup, but yeah. I put like two little tops of those in there. Add a little bit of cinnamon powder. Goes right in there. Mm, that's enough. I have to take this, this little plastic bag and I'm gonna pour the ice inside of this bag. Yeah, I'm making a mess, as usual. Put some ice in the bag right here. And after I do this, what I'm gonna do with this ice is that I'm gonna crush it because as as I said you don't want this machine to um get those big pieces of ice it's not good for that type of machine as my mom said <laughs> so now I'm crushing And that amount of ice is just right. Sometimes I overdo it and I like to put way more and I crush a little bit more, but that is just right. I wanna crush it really good because I don't want the machine to get stuck. So this is good amount of ice. Now, let's go in there. Now I have my milk. And this is the amount of milk because we want it to move while it's blending right so that's let's see if it moves let me throw a little bit more milk because we don't want it to get stuck so now it's time for this to blend and we want to do this quickly because you don't want the papaya to turn sour like at all Plugging this here quickly in. We're gonna start with the low. So what happens here is that 
it's got so much papaya that it needs to move a little bit so i'm gonna move this a little bit you know give it some more time for it to stir and let's do this one more time now let's see if it moves <laughs> So, you know, have a fit right after <laughs> my mess. I'm just gonna take some of, and then I'm gonna dry it up and leave it nice and clean for her to not catch a fit. <laughs> All right, so now I'm gonna open this up and I'm gonna take some of this juice. And as you can see, That looks really good and this can be your breakfast, you know. Oh, that is that looks really good right now. I have the top here. I put it on. And alright, so All right, just taste this. This is really nice and sweet. It tastes really good. And I don't want to like show my face right now. I'm a little bit, I'm not like ready because I just woke up and my hair is totally messed up. But this is really good for like breakfast. Like I really recommend this. This is healthy as well. So yeah. This juice was really good, and the only, the only thing I didn't like it was way too sweet for me. Do not put that that amount of sugar if you don't want it too sweet. For my mama, it would be perfect. She loves it like this, really sweet. But I don't like mine super super sweet. I like it like very mild, sweet, almost with no sugar at all. So yeah, but it was really good. I'm 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 almost done, and like five seconds <laughs> so yeah